guys, welcome back to another episode of Farming Simulator 15 Gold Edition with me, Brad M73. Uh, we are starting, uh, I guess we're gonna do some, uh, uh-oh. <laughs> we're gonna do, we're gonna deliver this, what is going on with this, oh. I guess I need to learn how to use this stupid thing. Um, we're gonna start off by delivering this, uh... Package? Is this a package? Uh, we're gonna cut down some trees, and I'm gonna have to give a shout out to somebody because <clears throat> somebody pointed out. Let me see if I can find out who this person was because somebody gave me a really good suggestion. I actually tested it out. I, I thought I had tested it out previously, but apparently I did not. And it actually worked exceptionally well and so that person is going to get a shout out as soon as i figure out who it is so i'm i'm trying to pull it up on my phone i don't know how successful i'm going to be um my desk is a mess i need to clean off my desk i would be absolutely embarrassed for any of you to see my desk right now because it is really bad um let's see here anders simonson simonson i'm gonna say anders simonson thank you so much for the suggestion um you suggested using the ramp and i swear i thought i had done that before but i couldn't get it to work but i tried it again uh last night i think i just loaded up some logs and tried it work beautifully and so we're gonna do that in this episode i'm gonna show you guys if you're you know getting into the forestry stuff um where am i going oh gosh no i have no idea where i'm going oh, i'm going up to the grain elevator okay which i think is going to be right across the road here We're going to figure this out. Um, yeah, if you guys are getting into the forestry, stay tuned this episode. We're going to find out. I am going to show you guys how to make tons of money with forestry. And, oh, no. Oh, no. All right. Well, that did not. Okay, so I am <laughs> going to have to go across the bridge here. Oh, I can't get up that way. I'm just driving in circles, guys. I don't know. I have no idea. Uh, we still have the tractors and stuff going. I, I actually got those guys running before I even started uh, playing. Or b before I started recording, I'm sorry. So those guys are going, man, I should have turned down that road right, right over there. I could have come right up there. Bam, been done. But no. And I think that... I don't think we have any more delivery missions. I'm going to just go through the woods here. And I'm chewing gum. I, I usually don't do that. It's, like, really rude, I'm sure. I, 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 I. But I have really bad breath. And so, no, I'm just kidding. Um, or maybe I'm not. I don't know. <laughs> uh, let's see. What, how are we doing here? All right. Okay, so. What I'm going to do... We're going to try to pick up all the scraggly, not scra, all the stragglers. That's what I'm, that's what I'm trying to say here. Oh, please just stay in my grasp long enough for me to drop you into the trailer. <clears throat> Yay, yay. All right, cool. Good enough. Good enough. Um, so basically, this method of pick, of uh, delivering the logs is is going to be a lot faster. I know I, you know, I've been going. Uh, George is still here. She is. I don't know what she's doing. Maybe <clears throat> maybe she was trying to sleep and she got mad. I don't know if you could hear her puffing and puffing there a second ago, but if you heard like a weird huff puff sound, that was probably her. 
Um, because she just got up and <laughs> walked out of the room. It's not really late here. It's only like 10 o'clock um, on Tuesday. What is it today? The 5th of January, 2016. Um, so, yeah. She, uh, it's not late. Like I said, it's, she's, I don't know. I don't know why she's mad at me. Oh, no. She just came in and plopped down on the floor. Are, do you think I'm weird because I'm sitting here talking to myself again? I'm looking at her and she's like winking and just being her cute self. I put a photo in her in the last video. Um, I put a photo of her in the last video. And um, at least I think I did. I'm pretty sure I did. If I didn't, then I just failed the internet. Okay, seven meters length. Ay, 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 ay. Okay, all you smart Alex who think you uh, think it's possible to pick up logs and put them in directly into the backs of the trailers. I'm telling you guys, it's it's not feasible because of the way you have to perfectly align the trees. And every time, if the tree is off, just a little bit, it's going to muck the whole thing up. And you're not going to be able to do it. And I'm going to show you again, since you guys aren't listening, or you don't believe me, or something. I don't know what the deal is. Alright, so we have this, we have this log rough, roughly aligned with the hole that it's supposed to fit into. Well, not the hole, but... You get what I'm trying to say. Um, and... Uh, you see what I'm saying? I'm... Screw this. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> I can't... I can't deal with it anymore! The tree physics just do not allow themselves... Oh, now... Um, they don't allow themselves to, to really work properly in the way that you would think they work. This, you know, even though these games are simulations, I promise they are, um, they're not really very intelligent. And you have to be able to work with them as they've been designed. See, I want to... You know, even that one, it didn't even freaking go in there. I had it lined up fairly good, fairly well, didn't work. So, yeah. Now, now I hope that explains to you why I don't load the logs directly into the trailers. Because it is not feasible to do. Now, some people might have ninja skills. You got, you know, there might be somebody out there. I've never seen anybody do it. I, I said a video or two ago, I've looked around online to see if there's people who do it well and consistently. I've not been able to find one. If you guys find one, you know, send me the message. But I don't know, maybe I'm just, you know, too much of an idiot or something to do that. And, uh, it, and, I, and I can't get it to work. So anyway, that's why, that's why. That's why I don't feed the logs directly into the trailers for all you non-believers. <laughs> uh, all right, so we're gonna we're gonna try to get this uh, logging trailer filled up as as much as we can. Um, we're gonna send it down to the um, to the drop-off point. Crane yard, whatever. We'll tear the lumber yard. On. All right, there we go. Okay. 
get this one. I'm just gonna, uh, I don't know. Maybe I can pick this one up. Let's see. I get that little hopefully I can get that little twig log there at the same time all right oh man come on pick it up come on get her in there get her turned around there it over line it up drop it all right try to get this guy in there and then we're gonna go check on the law the not the logs we're gonna go check on our, the rest of our tractors and stuff make sure everything's moving along okay at the farm because we haven't really done much of that yet this episode um, all right so he's almost finished with this field he's gonna be done with that field and Let's see, I think we actually have another, yeah, we've got another day of sunlight, which is a perfect day to plant canola. We better get this guy back to the farm. <clears throat> and uh, just get him seeding more canola. don't have any loan right now which is good so we're complete ninety nine thousand dollars in the green um, my objective in this episode is to actually buy a new tractor we're gonna get one of the dudes fars I'm uh, I don't know if I should get the black or green one yet I like the black one it's just cool I just want to get this guy started on seeding for right now. And we're just going to seed more canola. Because I believe in the canola great demand. I don't know. Probably never going to get another great, great demand. Um, a, a lot of you guys keep asking me what this little, <clears throat> the mod is for, for, well, you can see my mouse, and it shows you how much canola is in all of the, um, well, not canola specifically, but, you know, how much grain is in each of the vehicles and so on and so forth. That is called the Inspector Mod. It is an Inspector Mod version 2.4. I've mentioned it many times in previous episodes. I don't know why you guys um, aren't remembering it or something, but um, that's what it's called, the Inspector Mod. All right, so because loading up the logs there is kind of a pain in the butt, I'm going to come back here to this flat area. Um... We're going to drag a tree back with us. So maybe we can get it aligned properly. I highly doubt it, but you never know. Uh, why can't it go up this hill? Oh. I guess because there's a tree stump right there in the way. Nope, go the other way. Alright. Alright, so. Ah, no, no, no.
So we are going to try kind of line this tree up. Because I think this one has a pretty good chance of success, I think. Get lined up just a little bit more. And <clears throat> we'll cut. Huh? Not too bad. Oh gosh. See, why did that one go? Oh, I see. All right. Apparently we have to be fairly careful and then the tree itself starts to shift around a little bit so it just does some really wonky things and let's see. Oh, that actually worked out pretty good. Okay, maybe I'm developing my ninjas my nin my ninjutsu. I was gonna say my ninjit my my ninjitchery. Ninjitsuri. Oh, I don't even know what I'm trying to say. Alright. Get those logs to fall down. Now I just need to like run it into something here. Get them all bonked forward and bam up. Oh. A little bit more speed there. Bonk. Okay, there we go. All right, so let's try that again. Maybe, um, maybe I jumped the gun when I went on my tirade earlier. Um, all right, we're gonna try. We're gonna try that again. All the people were that were like. Yeah, man, I told you you could get it in there. Like, they're just totally, you know, <laughs> they're totally unsubscribing right now. Okay. What are you guys doing? Okay. Whoop. All right. So again, we're going to try to kind of line it up here. Hit the X button to cut and Bon eh, not too bad. Try it again. Oh, this one's not. Oh. Okay, not bad. Let's um let's try to get like another load on there. I am going to see if I can kind of knock these, uh, knock these logs into place a little bit by doing this. There we are. And there we go. I think we'll probably be able to get like one more load in there. I, you know, guys, I'm kind of impressed with my skills. I didn't honestly think that I was going to be able to do that, but I guess if you, you know, position your trailer properly and, you know, drag them kind of so that they'll be straight, you know, you're going to have a much better chance on um, getting them in there correctly. So anyway, let's try to do one more. Let's, uh, oh, <clears throat> he's almost done. 
but we shall uh, we shall carry on seeding field 19 Oh, and you guys keep asking. Oh, sorry, Georgia. That's what you get. That's what you get for laying down there. <laughs> I just, I kind of just stepped on my dog a little bit. Not too bad though. She's all right. Um. And then a few of my OCD um, subscribers, and I know I'm kind of this way too. Um, I've gotten some complaints about cleaning my vehicles off. Um, the reason why I haven't done it yet is because, you know, you have to buy the, uh, the little washer and it's expensive and yeah. Um, and plus I don't know where, really where I would put it. Um, but where'd it go? Cannot be placed here. It appears over there. Can I put it over here, maybe? Over here? Left? No. Oh. I guess I just put it right there, then. Whoops. <laughs> uh, Alright, so he's almost finished. Let's stop this driver. Come on, put out the boom. Not going to. Darn it. All right, I'm gonna say drive course, drive now. I'm gonna have this guy drive course, drive now, drive now. And, um, okay. Ah, da 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 da. Okay, so that's why you don't want to do that. Uh oh. Yeah, see this one, not looking too good, because it's not aligned well, and let's see Get over like this way. There we go. Um, I'm really sure this is gonna work to like work the way I'm wanting it to work, but we'll find out. No, it did not. Uh, 
not gonna work. I think I'm wanting. Okay. Oh, the little one worked, kind of. Uh, let's drive out of here first. Because that's definitely going to be, you know, full load. Okay. Okay. Ah. Uh, zoom in here a little bit. Whoa, what the heck? Grab this one, I guess. Don't roll away from me. Don't you roll away from me. This guy should be able to fit right over here. And the dog is looking at me. She's knocking her tail against my desk. She probably has to go either to the, the side that is out, if you get what I mean. If I say it, she'll spaz out, and then I won't be able to get anything done. She's breathing against me, acting frustrated. She's looking straight into my eyes with her cute little gaze. <laughs> Georgia. <clears throat> Come on, get it. There we go. All right, so after this log, we're going to be on our way down to the, uh, the lumber yard. Oh, gosh. <gasps> oh, oh. Oh, it was so close. I just wanted to pick it up and not even, like, drop it off, really. All right, let's get it right in the middle this time. Pretty close. Okay. All right. Drive course, first waypoint, go. All right, so he's going. All right, let's stop these guys. And first and foremost, we're going to need to start cleaning these guys off, right? Because if I don't, you know, people are just going to go crazy. Yay! Oh look, I haven't even really sprayed this side and it's, you know, pretty clean already. Spray, subtract, so spray. Somebody told me at one time that like if you spray the, like whatever the name brand is for the whole you know, the whole vehicle will be cleaned. All right, so there we finally have a clean vehicle. Whoever was like, clean your vehicles, I hope you're happy. <laughs> and why is my mic so far away from me now? Oh. All right. 
Now, I'm not going to clean off the cedar. The reason should be relatively obvious because it's going to be dirty by the time we're done with it anyway. So we're going to go over to the opposite side of the field where the Rastelmash is. We're going to get We are going to get seeding over here. Okay. That out of the way. And I'm going to hire the worker to do that. And I guess we'll drive this guy back. Um, he'll have to pick up the, uh, what is it, the, um, oh, that guy's done too, okay. He's gonna pick up the fertilizer sprayer, we'll get uh, fertilizing done. Could you imagine if crops actually grew in a day, like how world hunger would basically not be a problem anymore? The world would probably be a gigantically overpopulated place as it is already, but we probably wouldn't be very hungry. Or I don't know, maybe we would. Spraying the Z-Tor Major. Do you know, we'll just <coughs> spray this farm tech logo, and after a few seconds, the whole thing will be clean. And that pretty much sums that up. Gotta line them up perfect, pixel to pixel. All right. Oh my gosh. There we go. <laughs> we'll get that last field seeding. Field, what, 15 slash 20. So I'll tab down to the uh, the buffalo as soon as I get the message that um, you know that we've gotten to the drop-off point or the holding point or whatever it's called. In the meantime, I might go ahead and wash off my Zetor. Wait, no, Rostelmash. Yeah, it says it's right on the back. It says Rostelmash. So I don't know. I'm saying it in kind of a Germanic Germanic accent. All right, this, the buffalo is almost down there. There it is. He has reached the waiting point. As soon as this is clean, we'll go down there and, and get him. You can sell, 
sell the logs. So guys, um, be sure to pay attention. I'm only going to show you this once. No, I'll probably show it to you again in the future. All right. Wait. I'm going to get this guy seating first. Because that would be the responsible thing to do, right? Right. Okay. Okay, so. What we're going to do is we're going to stop the driver. And then what I... First of all, you want to stay away from the sell point. Because if you drive over that, your logs are going to disappear and you're going to sell them for like half the price. So what we're going to do, we're going to drive, we're going to back up on this thing over here. And then we're going to bump the logs right into there. So we're going to go do that right now. Hopefully this log will quit flipping around. It's on the back because it's making me nervous. <clears throat> and actually, I think we can... Just hit B for changing the driving directions. You can just back it in like this. And so instead of having to go through all of the trouble, uh oh. Oh, come on. Now it's going to give me a problem. Oh my god! Oh, I see which one it is. It's because one of the logs... Uh-huh. Alright. Oh, going the wrong way again. Now we should go be able to go right up there. Booyah! I don't know how much we got, but it was quite a lot. And now I feel seem like I'm stuck. Oh, no, I'm not stuck, I guess. Looks like I'm getting a little bit... Well, let's see. Some of the logs I'm getting, you know, like, what I normally get. Other ones it seems like I'm getting less for. I don't know. Maybe, maybe I... Ah... Uh, <clears throat> need to try to get these two logs here. Okay, and then... <clears throat> we had another log up here, didn't we? Yes, we did. So, see, that took a lot less time, right? So, thank you to Anders. For the suggestion, that definitely worked. And let's see if I can get this last one in there. Okay, and then we still have a little tiny log. I'm just going to drive right over this. There we go. And we're going to jump out and we're going to send the train off. And now um we're going to drive this guy back up to the uh well wherever he needs to go. Okay. So we're going to continue on. We're going to be uh, fertilizing here. We're going to have very close to 200,000. Go.
And another thing I'm going to kind of need is I'm going to need a larger tipper as well. How much time do we have? I need to look and see. <gasps> what? Oh, okay. Oh, we've only got about 20 minutes left or so. So... Um... I guess I'll get some logs prepared. Wait, should I do that now or should I? Uh. Uh. All right, let's clean off this other combine. That's what we'll do. Okay. We'll get this guy up there, get him cleaned off, see where the, the uh, buffalo is going to be. The reason why I'm not chopping the logs up like last time, well, like previously, is because I want to see... I want to actually try to get them aligned with the trailer now. Because um, it could potentially be a time-saving... You know, a time-saver thing. Savings... Saving time? Uh... <laughs> Let's get him out of the way. All right. We'll just spray the new Holland logo and see what happens. And it's clean, I guess. Okay. On to the new Holland. Well, it's all new Holland. I'm just going to stand up here, you know, it'll be pretending like it's raining. All right, so this field's about halfway done. This field's about halfway done. Let's see where we are. Getting fairly close. Um, I do think we are going to have enough by a tipper, and I want to buy a decent sized tipper. Like this one's 40,000. And when I say forty thousand, I'm talking about the capacity, not how much they cost. Um, this one might be a good one to use for. What else do I have? For, yeah, see, these are getting way too expensive. I kind of want to get this one. See what? I'm going to go ahead and buy that one for right now. And then. We're going to borrow some money. We are going to buy. I'm going to buy the green dudes far this time because last time. We bought the black one, and so I'm just going to buy the regular one this time. And then later, we can come back and get the, um, the other one. So now, what, I'm gonna, my, what my plan is, because we're going to have to cut down all those trees, is um, 
We're gonna cut the trees down. And then... I'm going to try. I don't know how successful I'm gonna be. But I am going to try to use the in-game chipper to chip the trees. Um, if that doesn't work, then I'll just go ahead and buy the Brux like I've done in last season. I like the Brux. I think it works great. I just wish that it had more realistic textures. That's all I'm going to say about that. All right. Okay. Anzi Scorpion is almost back. Um, oh, still up there. Look at that tractor, dude's far. So we're less than a month away from uh, year. What is it? Uh, American Truck Simulator's release on February third, um, eight a.m. tomorrow morning Pacific time on the sixth. The Oculus Rift goes live for pre-orders. I will be pre-ordering one. I'm, I'm going to be up at eleven o'clock or well before then. Getting the page loaded up, reloading the page, all that good stuff, so that I can get my Oculus, uh, you know, pre-ordered. I don't even know what the stats, like the specs of it are. I'm just gonna order one because it's like the full release version. And supposedly, if anybody backed a dev kit, th those people will get one for free. How cool is that? Now I'm kind of kicking myself in the butt for just for not, you know, backing one earlier because I should have, and then I would have got a free one. So. Oh well, <laughs> who knew, right? I know the original Kickstarters, like if you were part of the Kickstarters, um, I'm pretty sure that they said that those people would get them if you... Ah, no! I, I need to redo this course so that it has a another stopping point. Anyway, um, yeah, if you, you know, if you backed it, then, uh, you know, you would, you know, you would naturally get it, but, um, you know, who knew? Okay. I think that's going to pretty much do it right about there. Okay. Okay. All right, how are we going to do this? Okay. No, not this again. See, I don't think the Ponzi's are really, you know, doing a lot of this dragging. Um, I think they would primarily just cut the thing off, you know, right where it fell. And I've never seen them used on these big, huge trees. Um, in videos and stuff, they're always using them on, you know, fairly smaller trees. You know, let, I'd say maybe a foot in diameter... Um, maybe a little bit more, but this, this tree here looks like a good, you know, two and a half, three feet in diameter, so I don't know. Okay. Alright, so. What's gonna happen? Ah. Eh.
Oh. 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 Okay. Well, that's interesting. Was not expecting it to do that. Ran this guy into a tree. Okay, good. And bam. Better. Ah. All right, come on. Okay. All right, back over. Let's see here how we're doing. <clears throat> Just doing okay. I think we'll be able to get. Let's see how much time do we have left? We have, and we've got about a little less than ten minutes left. I think. I don't know whether or not we're going to be able to get. Um. We're not going to be able to get the. Um, the trees down to the uh, drop-off point, but I might be able to have it there for the beginning of the next episode. Because we'll, we'll easily be able to get another 100,000 there. Still no great demands of any kind, which is increasingly frustrating. I, I have definitely honed my ninja skills this episode. Well, I may have spoken too soon. Come on now. Okay, I kind of spoke too soon there. But I, I, you know, honestly, I am a bit surprised that I was able to get these loaded up. Because, I, honestly, I've tried. Maybe I just needed the I needed, I needed the anger within myself. I needed to turn to the dark side. <laughs> All right. So I guess it does work. It just kind of is dependent on where you know, where you set up your vehicles and how they, you know, work together to accomplish the task of loading them directly into the trailers. Now, if you had two people in multiplayer, it might work a little bit better with two people working together, but it's it's kind of been a while. I can't, come on now. It's kind of been a while since I've actually um, played multiplayer with anybody. Um, I don't... I get so many people that ask me, like, Hey, let's play Farming Sim together, and it's just not possible. I get so many requests. Um, I wish there were, like, 20,000 of me to, <laughs> to be able to play with everybody, but there's just not, and unfortunately my time's limited. Um... But yeah, I think you know if you're if you're playing with your buddies and your friends, um, 
you know, it'll pr it might work a little bit better. Or might not. I don't know. Okay, so that field is finished. And then we'll get uh, we'll get to cultivating. Oh, I'm like, is that already growing? Not cultivating. We will get to fertilizing the last field, and then uh, we're gonna really start trying to uh, work toward purchasing uh, field 25, and then merging those fields together. So that'll come here. In the next few episodes, we just have to, you know, get our chipper. Hopefully that thing works. Um, if it doesn't, I'm going to have a, a hissy fit. Um, all right, let's see about... Let's see about getting another tree. Maybe we can squeeze one more tree in here. If we try really hard, that's what she said. Though I was really uncomfortable when she said it. Uh, <laughs> Ew. Brayad. This one might line up pretty well. Oh, no. See, it keeps it keeps kind of dragging off into one direction, kind of over towards the left. I don't don't exactly know what causes that, but that's just the way it works. Gotta love them American video game physics. Now it'll start shifting back the other way, probably, and well, looking pretty good. Okay, so we got another successful load of logs. Um, not sure if that's going to be like a full fifty thousand dollar load or not, but ah, da -da 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 -da. Just uh, ram into the trees. Yeah, I think I think we might actually be able to get another load on there. Ah. Or at least, you know, kind of like one of the smaller trees. So that will have to wait until the next episode. I'm sure we're going to have a traffic jam here. Um, I knew that was going to happen. I'm going to close things out. We're going to let these guys finish up their fields. And, um, and when we come back in the next episode, uh, we'll have the, uh, the logs ready to sell. And, um, and I'll have my tractors and stuff ready to wash off. And then we'll also be ready to you know, start on the next harvest. So thank you guys so much for watching for you know another episode of farming simulator is behind us again happy new year this is the what is it the second episode of the new year uh 2016 i'm gonna have to get used to saying that and writing it down more importantly and um you know don't forget to like share please comment please subscribe this has been farming simulator 
15 Gold Edition. I'm Brad M73, and we will see you guys next time. Bye for now.